official grand gala rehearsal i have been dancing for 20 years and never have i ever gotten the chance to dance at grand gala and it almost missed me this year though you know but i started late and yesterday was my first rehearsal it wasn't much of a struggle because the dance is not that technical but the doll don't dance for about two three months now for two months i don't dance fully from june from may so to just jumping the doll paying up the doll paying up <laughs> relaxing getting my mind and my body ready to dance but there are essentials must have for grand colors also I have my water well this is for me my water um I have my singles um because we may have to practice outside and we may also well we are going to the national stadium tomorrow so we need those I have my airpods I have my charger, um, I have my biofree spray because in, in the doll paid up and I have a little toiletry bag with a few stuff. So, that's it. So today is Grand Gala rehearsal day three. We were told to pack as light as possible, so this is the bag I'm working with today. So in the bag, I'll put some identification, my mask, my biofree spray, a pair of socks, um, my keys, and I'll be walking with my charger, my AirPods. I'll walk with my sneakers in my hand, and I will also walk with my water bottle. In my hand. <laughs> Today was my first day um, in the stadium and it wasn't that bad but I am extremely tired for like three consecutive days of rehearsals. So it's day four of Grand Gala rehearsals. Um, rehearsal starts at four o'clock. Um, it's 4.30 now but I had to stop at Starbucks because I needed a little stuff before I actually started rehearsal. I'm tired. It's, it has just been four days. This will be my second day in the stadium and I'm tired. I must say it is an experience, it's just very tired, so that's just it. <laughs> So this is my second week, second and final week of gala rehearsals. Um, I go to the stadium today, but it's my first day also, but and I'm expecting that this week is going to be extremely hectic because it's the last week Grand Gala is on Saturday. Today is Wednesday. So I'm expecting it to be extremely hectic because grand rehearsals and all of that will be happening in this week. I am, however, trying to prepare myself both mentally and physically. So I get jelly from my league over the weekend. So I just going to open it and put it in my bottle take my vitamins pack my bag and just get ready for the grand rehearsals because i'm um, anticipating, anticipating that it is going to be very tiresome um it's going to be a lot because this week we are going to be fixing everything everybody's gonna be coming in dress rehearsals um proper placements 
so it's going to be a lot and i am genuinely preparing myself for it to be a lot because i don't necessarily want to be caught off guard um especially because we will be dancing with so much people and there will be a lot a lot of teachers a lot of dancers from different backgrounds and we're dancing to different things so um i'm anticipating a lot so let's see how those anticipations play out for the rest of the week and into saturday which is grand gala so today is day four of gala rehearsals week two the final week um i'm in the stadium today at it starts at 10 a.m it's like 9 50 now um it's pretty empty for now so i'm just here and the essential for today was sunscreen and a hat because the sun is right like it's extremely hot like i just put on the sunscreen and i can feel it sweated off already so yeah i'll keep you guys updated throughout the day because i'll be here for the whole day so you guys may get like a whole day vlogging of me being in the stadium for the entire day so yeah we have been here all morning um it is one o'clock and we are yet to go on the field we have just been rehearsing to ourselves and at this point jesus are tired and we're not going to find the feeling. Just try on the top yeah. because it's, so it's costume time. Yes, sir. And it's, yeah, it doesn't really look like it. <laughs> and it's costume time. Yes, sir. And it's costume time. The first, it's like, it's like food. The first thing you see is the costume. Do you taste it? No, they're not going to go on it. Only for Aroma. You can go on a pirate ship. They don't, they don't, they don't. Aroma. and things are looking up so we're have, about to have our dress rehearsal so this is the costume and everybody is getting dressed and ready for the dress rehearsal what? say hi Sherry hi <laughs> no Shelly really come tell me something look like a mother no <laughs> <laughs> Look at the costumes. This is this is what this is what early nineties church wear. Here, Victoria say look like blue mud. No man. How is rehearsal for you guys so far? Right. I want to go. See, drop them. Right, I'm very very tired. When I'm all right though, it's like two dances under the naughty. Yep. We too. This is now eight minutes past twelve. I just got home from the last day of Grand Gala rehearsals. We had a rehearsal earlier, and then we had dress rehearsals at six o'clock, and that lasted until about ten. 19 then we had to wait for a few things call time is at noon tomorrow so i'm going to jump right in the shower and just get ready for bed one of the expectations that did live up was me being extremely tired i'm very very tired and i'm in a lot of pain i'm having um shin splints is when your shin hurts like you can't be nishin, 
but it is in a lot of pain so i can't really walk so i can walk but to step down it's extremely hot my ankles my knees and the flags that we dance with are extremely heavy so my right shoulder is hurting because i use my right shoulder but at some point in the dance i use two flags but it's just really affecting the right shoulder because i dance with the flag throughout the entire dance so i'm just going to head to the just try to get some rest because i know i have a full day ahead tomorrow so see you guys tomorrow again for the rest of the updates and to get ready with me for grand gala so it's show day um call time is at noon it's now 11 o'clock i've been up from about six because we had to go get um tickets for my mom but i must say i'm extremely tired i got sleep but i just felt like i needed more rest so i'm about to head to the stadium well i may have to make a few stops before i may have to get something to eat because i don't eat anything from morning i've been on the road all morning um i went to get powder for my face the place was locked so i probably have to go try fontana or any other pharmacy and i need um, my eyeshadow palette so i need those things and i need food so today is show day guys so come along this journey with me as i just document my first ever grand gala i'm excited but i'm also tired so yeah i will definitely do a get ready with me and i will show you the final outfit i'll show you the final face i'm not a makeup artist and i don't really wear makeup that often but it's show makeup so it's gonna be more bold and out there so let's see what the doll can do on her face so i'll take you guys along with me for the day as much as i can because we don't really get to have our phones like that because we have to think about security and think about keeping our things safe so the phones are handed off quite often so i do get to video and capture a lot of the memories so yeah bye guys so it's makeup time so this is show makeup and show makeup is nothing like regular makeup this is not makeup that you would regularly wear on the road so this makeup is very extravagant so i'm just here prepping my face and everything remember guys i'm not a makeup artist i hardly wear makeup so come along this journey with me as i figure out how i am putting on this makeup because at one point I was even wondering if my concealer was too light because I have the concealer and I have the color corrector and everybody was saying no man but the makeup can go on and you can do makeup and all of that and me saying to myself is mm -mm. just come I could blend this out come I could just try to fit this as good as possible on our face because we don't want to look too white and we don't want to look like a dopey those cute pink brushes are from Shein. They're not, I wouldn't say they're the best, but they're not that bad. And I think I paid like a dollar fifty for 24 brushes. So the next clip will be the final makeup look. I didn't do the eyeshadows because I did not know to do it. So I asked Kayla to do that for me. This is the final makeup look. I just did my edges. So now it's time to change. And fully get ready because call time is 5 o'clock and it's now 4, 4.30. So we have 30 minutes to change and get ready. Everybody's eating and doing their makeup and the village. So yeah. So this is the part where I did not go to Fontana. And we get food over the grandstand stand. So, yes. So, when I change again, um, we're now fully dressed. Let me do a quick check. So, you check the head and the costume. So, yes. I am now fully dressed and just sitting and waiting because it's no call time it's eight minutes past call time so we're just sitting to cool off relax and really get ready for our first piece because 
um, Trendal is about to start and we are item 13 and item 13 comes very fast so here it is the final just had my first performance and I must say it was extremely good I am however tired it did not go 100% how I expected it to go but it was really good and I must say it has been an amazing experience so far I have about 10 minutes or so to reset for performance number two which will be the last performance for the night which is the biggest one because that would be the mass gospel section that one I'm anticipating that my arms will be hurting because in that one we use flags and the flags are extremely heavy and we also do a lot of running in that section so yeah this is the update and stay tuned for the second update but it has been an amazing experience so far and prep for the second dance you have a catch where we are we have a flag and we're ready Auntie Nikki Auntie Nikki this is going on YouTube, you know. Say hi okay. to the vlog. Everybody say hi to the vlog. to walk from the tunnel back over to Stadium East. I am in so much pain. Like, I'm literally laying down on the floor to the amount of pain I am in. So, I'll just be here. I'll update you guys again in a few. It is now 12.15. I just got home from Grand Gala and I must say I am exhausted I'm extremely exhausted but I just want to thank God for giving me the opportunity to dance well minister at Grand Gala it was fun it was exciting and it was very tiresome thank you for coming along this journey with me I really hope you enjoyed my journey and I really do hope you enjoy 
Grand Grand Gala. You can watch it on YouTube, I think, and One Spot Media. Um, at Grand Gala 2022. I must say it has been a journey though. Um, show day came and it was amazing. Um, big up God, of course, for the strength, the energy, because. The final dance, the We Are Soldiers dance, when I got off stage, I could not feel from my back to my ankles. I was like, <laughs> my back was hurting me so bad and I have shin splints. So the, the, the running and the jumping and everything, it just calmed down. I had to be held and carried out of the tunnel back to um, Stadium East under the tent and I had to lay down and I, I had to ice it as well but I'm good I still feeling a bit of pain so I'm just going to do the finishing takedowns and get so I dance tomorrow again at Portmore Gospel Assembly we're doing a cultural piece so I'm just going to do my finish take, finishing takedowns take off the makeup, take a shower, and just get some rest. Thank you guys for watching the vlog. Don't forget to like and share and watch everything just well. If you reach this far, you had already watched everything, but don't forget to like and share. And if you're watching and you don't subscribe, subscribe to the channel. Bye guys.